So you can see that Pip is back into the crate on her own. I'm sitting across from her. So she sees me. I'm gonna go ahead and drop this tree in here again, just to get her in there. Go ahead and grab my clicker. Okay, ready? Oh, you missed one. Look, you missed one, find it. Oh, you found it. Good girl. Okay, ready? Okay, in your crate. That's not how, try again. Yeah, so I'm gonna, I clicked her when her face was in. I'm gonna light her up. Okay. Good. Girl. Oh, thank you for the pretty. Thank you for the pretty. <laughs> Ready? In your crate. Can you go in your crate? Good. So she, if you notice, she is not, um, you know, real savvy on that in your crate. She doesn't know what I'm saying. And so, I'm just going to go ahead and stop naming it. Okay. And start inviting her out. And then capturing her and using my hands. So we'll see what she does. There we go. Good girl. So the position of my body changed. Okay. So I'm behind the crate now. Okay. Good girl. So I'm just going to go ahead and stand here. I'm gonna wait for Pip to give me something else other than just standing there. So she might give me a sit. Oh, she hurt me. Okay, good. Her sit is really strong, obviously. Okay, good girl. Good, now you notice what my clicks are is when they're, you know, halfway in, halfway out. So I'm clicking for going in, so as soon as she hits that green thing, then I'm gonna also wait, so no click. I'm moving my body, so she's thinking, so there she is. Okay, ready? Okay. So now she's sitting in the corner of the crate, and I just stood there, and I made, I didn't make her, but I asked her to wait. Ready? Good. She sits again. Good. Okay. Good. Ready? So I'm just gonna do a few of these. So before we were just, you know, clicking and treating her for going in. So she chooses to go out into her mat and then she gives me a down. Now, um, she didn't give me what I wanted, which was the sit in the crate. So what happens? Nothing, nothing happens. I don't correct it, but I also don't reinforce this. So I'm just gonna go ahead and tell her to try it again. Ready? Try again. Good. There we go. And that gets reinforced. And so I go ahead and reinforce that. Oh, we gotta sit pretty in there. <laughs> I taught her that a long, long time ago. Ready? Okay, Pip, what should you do? Go ahead. Good. So she's you know, listening, she comes out. Oh, she thought she saw a tree. So again, what happens if the dog, you know, doesn't hear the click, then the click means, yes, you're correct. But it also means, um, you know, that, oops. So she begs, you know, come on, let's go. I'm a little frustrated. So, Pippi, that's enough. So she's in the food part of her brain. So I'm gonna help her. In your crate. Good. Good. So, Pip's cue for me to, um, you know, when I move, she, when I move back, she goes right into a sit. When I move back from the crate, you can't see it, but that's what I did. And so she's gonna bark again. And she sits pretty. She's sniffing to see if there's any, oh, there is some there. Okay, ready? Okay. So I waited just a little bit longer. Okay. I'm gonna ask her, in your crate. That's my cue for I wasn't looking for. Pippi, <coughs> try again. 
You can hear my other pip happy on upstairs. Sorry. What should you do? Ah! Go ahead. Good. Good. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and end this one. This is session two. And then we'll do session three at another time. Thanks for watching.